course, I'm back with another really quick, of course, of course, poggers. Oh, no good man video. Just kidding, of course, song video. Uh, we kind of really didn't get like new news right here, though, but we kind of got some little new tidbits and stuff from, um, oh, that's all done. That's all. Um, from what, um, Kishimoto, pretty much some new stuff from Frontiers, like, you know, early, because we're getting a lot of like leaked stuff. Like, we got some footage, like, not that long ago, but like, um, could I say a few, like, like, almost maybe like a month ago now, um, or like, I could say probably like a month ago now at this point, that, um, he did confirm that pretty much, like, it looked like we had some new footage, like early footage from like a 2021 build of Sonic Frontier slash Sonic Rangers. I'm going to make a whole video for that though, because I do, because there's, there's some stuff I do want to talk about. We got a little bit more news for that. I'm going to make that into its own video. I just haven't had the time to properly sit down and do it yet because I've been so busy. I've been at work. Um, and just getting other stuff done in, in a nutshell. But yeah, I'm gonna try. I'm probably gonna upload this video like today though, because again, when new stuff comes out, I don't really like uploading it like day one though, because I was just like, yeah, I can just upload it later or make it like later video. But I don't mind uploading stuff like this day one. It gives me an excuse to, like to edit and do other stuff though. But hey, it happens. It happens. But yeah, though, of course. This um kind of I was saying really isn't like new news ish though, because I did see a lot of people kind of talking about it though, and just like little stuff like that. But um. Yeah, because we know the next DLC pretty much like people say, oh, the next DLC news is coming up soon. And I was like, okay, maybe people were referencing referencing this joke. But it says, Dr. Um, Kishimoto, I was like, why does that name sound so familiar? I was like, oh, yeah, he uh, he did work on colors. I think Forces as well. That explains a lot. And just, he did work on colors. I think he was like, really, I think he's like the main head team of colors, though. But it says, um, States Time, it says, the director of Sonic Frontiers has shared an info on the second update, which it was pretty much everybody freaking out about this image and referencing this up. To the game, we, um, yes, I do actually sound better, though. I actually got some sleep last night, and I do feel refreshed. Uh, we worked, uh, Climactic, um, Uranus, um, Open Zones Evolution, Comment on Chronos United, and Possible Retirement? Everything's in the post. So, yeah, I was like, yeah, I gotta make a video for this, because I actually did just see this this morning. I was like, I feel like, I feel like this is already out, though, but people were really rumoring it, talking about it, and stuff like that. So, I'm like, where is this leaking information coming from? But I was like, I might as well just make a full video, because I haven't really seen no one do it just yet, though. But people probably already done it by now. But I was like, yeah, I just, I want to give my full thoughts and opinions on it, how I do it. But they get a Sonic and all characters, of course. Um, for, um, finding on the info, though. Well, it looks like Sonic Prime, though, promo right there. That's something serious. But, yeah, um... Yeah, um, because it's not like Prime right now is kind of taking a break though, because it's going into the second season, and we still kind of got some new footage, so that's like new images from like the second season, so that's doing its thing. I'll probably make more videos for that soon. I haven't made a Sonic Prime video since like, she's a week. Like I dedicated Sonic Prime video since like the early leaks of it though. But yeah, gonna talk about it though, of course, cover over, cover over it though. Um, but yeah, pretty much like the second update, because they were like going around like, Hyper, the second update's coming up, the second update's coming up. And I'm like, what? Huh? Is it coming? It makes sense though, because I feel like we haven't gotten news for it yet, though, realistically. Let me move my mic up a little bit more. Uh, realistically, I feel like we haven't gotten news for it, though. Only, I don't want to get too close, because otherwise I sound like TV static. But, yeah. Um, the, I want to say, the in my uh, new chair cover, it feels so amazing. So, uh, that's been helping me out on videos, too. Get my back straightened up, though. It feels so much better. But, yeah, so they did confirm that. Um, uh, Not confirmed, but not, I, I, didn't want to, I didn't want to say that. I didn't want to say confirmed. Um... <clears throat> um they did mention that, um, not mention, but I can't, not, they didn't leak or say anything about this though, but I feel like because Sonic Central is coming up in June, it's always been in June no matter what, it's always going to be on June, I think June 1st or June 6th, I can't remember, it's sometime in June, um, of course, you know, and Sonic was announced for the summer games as well though, so I'll probably make a short on that, again, I got a lot of Sonic shorts coming up though, so, a lot of Sonic content is coming to the channel though, so yeah guys, we are cooking hard right now, with Sonic content coming up though, um, but yes though, um, they didn't mention that, um, not mention, but, uh, they didn't say anything about this. Um, because with some of the game stuff, though, they don't really do anything with that, though. They kind of maybe announced one little thing, but, because last year we got the Origins Collection, we got, like, new leaks, and stuff. was it last year, I think, for Sonic Central? I can't remember. Oh, uh, we got, like, Origins announced, and stuff like that, of course, little, like, you know, Frontiers and stuff like that announced, the teaser, first teaser we ever pretty much got. Um, even though people, it was already leaked, because, like, the one little new image we got, like, during, like, oh, yeah, Sonic's, you know, gaming, 30 years, and stuff like that, because it has been 30 years since the Blue Hedgehog just came out for the game, it came out in the world, so, we got, like, two movies, the first movie design was, like, wanted to burn forever, though, but, yeah, but, yeah, though, um, but, yeah, it makes sense, though, because he has been, it's been 10 years since Colors, and that game was successful, and Frontiers sold over almost, what, two, three point five billion copies. Again, I got some of the Sonic videos, news I wanted to make, though, coming up, though, so it's gonna be a lot of Sonic videos for the channel coming up. Even, like, little, little stuff I'm gonna, like, stall and talk about, though, because I am, but, um, 
Is that confirmed though? But we know the next, next update news is probably going to be in the song, in the new Sonic Central for June this year because, first of all, it's always been in June. Second of all, we're probably getting new screenshots, new stuff. Again, Sonic's birthday. It literally has an update for Sonic's birthday. So that was like, when I first saw that, I was like, Sonic Central. That's easy, easy, easy. That's Sonic Central right there. That's literally Sonic Central news. Like, we're going to get that for Sonic Central news this year. Like, it's going to be a whole bunch of, like, just, like, a whole big ball update for Sonic News. It won't be, like, that long. I think, like, 30, like, an hour, maybe, because last year we, and we got the Roblox stuff. But, yeah, enough of that talking that, about that, though. But, yes, though. Yes, yes, yes. I, um, I, it probably is going to be confirmed. I'm, I'm saying this now. Sonic Frontier like update, they're going to showcase it off at the, um, not Summer Games. They might, though. I don't know. They, they don't really do that. They just announce, like, new games. Little, new little stuff coming up for the summer. But yes, I, I I have a feeling they're gonna probably they're gonna, it's obvious that they're gonna do this. June's it's like gonna be Sonic's birthday, the twenty first, I believe, because Sonic Origins came out I wanna say almost like a year now. It came out during Sonic's birthday last year. Has it been a year? Jesus wheeze. It was like gonna go on the twenty first, I believe. So I feel like we're getting Sonic Central news, which makes sense around like here. Or like the beginning of June, I can't remember the but I can't remember. I gotta look up the when I um first made that video. Cause I do usually do all this stuff usually kinda day one. But in general though, honestly, um, when we get the Sonic like Central uh, beginning or the whatever, whenever they're gonna do it on your Sonic's birthday again, that's I feel like that's when the update's gonna come up for Frontier Sonic's birthday, actual birthday day. We're gonna get the update. The new next DLC for Frontiers is gonna be on Sonic's actual birthday because they do have a Sonic birthday um, update, and I feel like they're gonna do like the Sonic Central and that's in Sonic's birthday update for Frontiers. They're gonna do it during Sonic Central. It, it's obvious. It makes sense. They can show it off a little bit, tease it up a little bit, give us a new trailer, new stuff. That's it's obvious. Like that's all lined up. Like that's why they're taking so long with it. They could have easily be like, okay, we're gonna release update two right here, right there, right there. But no, 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 no. They are gonna release all that info during um Central so Sonic's birthday. Was that is gonna be in June? Saying this now, I'm gonna call it. I don't care. Yeah, because we know like originally like, with Sonic uh, going going back to this. Cause it looked like Raya and I think Kratos were like one island. We had caterpillar, caterpillar images from like the leaked um, Sun Granger slash um, Frontiers like early build. Like Gelato was like pretty much like almost island size. Super Sonic had like a flare. Little notices like that. Graphical updates and little like you know improvements like in the moves and everything. Because literally, I want to say pretty because like you know because modern day consoles the more stuff you put on there like more graphically you put on there the more space it takes up. Trust me, I have a lot of games like that. They take up too much space, or like you know, updates are too big and they can't take too much storage, though. So it makes sense. Probably storage and like data limits, which back in the day, Sega did that do a lot with Sonic 2 CD, early Sonic games. But yeah, that's pretty much how like I want to see the fleet images we saw, though. But yeah, it says, um, I'm gonna read the food, I'm gonna read this now. They're probably gonna end the video because I talked so much during the video. But yeah, though, this immediately is uh, it was planned for further development in the open zone format, um, in the blues room, which is all the important stuff. Um, the what is pretty much all the talking and everything would only happen in the next part but some new ideas were introduced in Sonic Frontiers in the second update it says Kishimoto has um, made sure that the new game will have its director as Sonic uh, Kishimoto has made sure that the new game with his um, as him as the Sonic um, Frontiers director at Sonic Frontiers which he did a really good job thank you so much um, gets a better score than previous work Sonic Forces has already been known for the, um, Sonic Forces and he has already known that the next project will be um and will try um even better however if he fails he's considered giving up the role as a game director which i kind of mainly kind of get me because forces was lagged on because again it was pretty much made for kids i think in, like early like um like trailers and like early like anything for for, for um, forces they do mention that you know it was made easier for pretty much kids because forces pretty much is for kids though the game was pretty cheap like you can get for like 10 bucks now like steam sales and like christmas and like fall sales and stuff like that it's like 10 bucks which is yeah i, I thought that again so short though you could be in like two or three hours but on top of that like i said forces really was mainly made for kids though like the customization the game is so easy you can be in like two like two minutes like levels like two three minutes which makes sense. Though Kazakh Sonic, he did not need to be there. So, a lot again. I feel like the story had to be rewritten like at least two or three more times. He already has known that for the next project will be up. To make sure. Oh, yeah. But yeah, man, it makes sense though. If the man's tired of making games, he's tired of making games. If he gives up, he fail. If he gives up, he gives up. If he wants to um, retire, that's his thing. Like, I mean, Aaron Rubber literally left to like do more Sega stuff for like um other Sega things. So it makes sense. So like, it was Aaron Rubber. I, I can't remember what video I did that for. Uh, Kronos was divided up into three islands, which makes sense because the island, the first, if, it, if Rhea and Kronos were originally one, the island would have been crazy though, because I just did the, um, I've been playing through Sonic for years, so, like, I'm, I'm on the last island right now, and I was activating all the towers in the, um, before, um, yesterday I was activating all the towers, although, yeah, if Kronos and Rhea were one, this, this would be it though, which I feel like the last island is pretty much Kronos 2.0 with bigger maps, which I love though, honestly, the island was just fun to run around. 
<laughs> that was like 20, 30 minutes of me just goofing off, just running around. Got um, Mystic Lake from um, Block Knight, and I was rocking up to that. Now, because of technical uh, in, um, in limitations, okay, so I pretty much confirmed it wasn't like technical limitations or graphic wise. But after negative feedback from testers, which I, I get, probably because like the early build, like people got to go like to Hawaii, and like I know some comic giant did that too. Like he made a whole video in retrospective on like him going to like Sun Frontiers in Hawaii. He had a lot of complaints and everything, so it makes sense. So I feel like that was a big testing ground because again, that was pretty, I think one would say at a full build, but like an early almost finishish build, like an 85% almost done. Because I did mention that 85% slash, you know, the game is at 85 slash 90% slash 100% almost done though. In like some of the early league videos I did for Frontiers, like the Sage, the Titans, and everything, they called them United Island. Um, too big, probably because there's so much to do, like one big island though. And they were bored, and the fact that there was only grass all over <laughs> splitting the island helped mix, uh, helped mix it up other islands that avoid um, over saturation, which pretty much makes sense because you know, Raya and Kronos kind of feel like the same island though, but uh, with one biome, which makes sense. So, like I said, uh, but nevertheless, though feedback has been improved, um. This is the change. Kishimoto feels like Uranus um still lacks in exciting in ex exciting um climactic mood and it is the island to um be um repetitive. Right now the team is working on something to fix it. Um I'll fix it. That's why I'm waiting for the DLC though, because I'm not gonna beat the game just yet. I'm gonna wait for the DLC. Uh for me personally. It says Morimoto Morimoto? M Morito San Morito San uh, I say Morito. Um Lego Drop and Onset. Has also seen more um seen some videos on fan um improvements to the game, which I mean, like, Spin Dash is pretty much coming to Frontiers, we know about that already, and is expired by, um, ideas such as, um, um, eliminating the delay on enemies, during homing attack, new animations, ooh, nice, which I think which is coming in some of the new updates, which I think they mentioned, new, um, speed improvement when jumping and other, um, and others, there's other word or what, on whether any of these will appear in the future updates, but may, many changes will, in his opinion, were really important and, um, interesting, which actually I do like these last two ones, though, because, you know, um, I really do like those because honestly, um, like I said though, um, again, they can only do so much though. And you know, with, um, cause Rhea and Kronos, they don't really feel the same though. Cause Rhea feels so huge. And it was like a one and done island pretty much though. Cause you're activating all the towers, but the last island's pretty much like kind of Kronos, which has a lot of like, you know, new enemies and you know, kind of a little bit over cause all that enemies are just kind of copy and pasted like tower or. Um, the ninjas, you know, Shindra, everybody, like, not Shindra, but, um, et cetera, et cetera, though, which kind of makes sense, though, because, you know, you don't want to, you know, make, like, one big island, you know, you had, you had to, you know, keep grinding, keep going and going and going like that, though, because I am really on the last island right now, which kind of makes sense, though, like I said, you don't want to, um, what's up with that? You don't want to like oversaturate it. You don't want to do too too much. So you don't want to go like too too far because otherwise you you know get so dragged out and burned out and doing like so much stuff. Oh, okay, let me for that. Sorry for that. Because you don't be you don't want to be drained out and you don't want to do too too much. Like I said though, but um, yeah, which kind of makes sense. So that's pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over today. But like I said though. See you guys though, thanks for watching, have a great day, great life, all good you get them, make sure stay safe, watch and God bless all of you, everyone, out in the world, massive, and hope people are ready to get back to the game, go outside, subscribe to the company, and show them up from the Discord, so it's where, because it's awesome, so what you think about all this info and news, did you like it, you hate it, I like it though, personally though, um, just to get that, um, intro out the way, that's okay, in the video, a later, a little later, because I do want to talk about this a little bit more. Like I said, it does make sense though, because again, you don't want the items to be too much big, you don't want to oversaturate your department, you don't want to do too, too much. And like I said, though, it, 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 yeah, because by Chronos, I was just so drained out and tired. Chaos, I was so drained out and tired from all the mountains, and like over, like just everything felt like it was the same. I just kept falling and falling, and just for me, Chronos was just like experience was like, so much just two D. Like I, for, personally, for me, I have like this is the problem I have with Chronos. It just felt like I was just doing the same thing three hundred more times. It just I was like, man, I'm just ready to just destroy night, which I had fun with that night fall boss fight. I was just like, man, I'm just ready to just. Like leave Kronos, so I mean, um, chaos. I, I think Kronos is probably my favorite island, though. I like Eris too. It's a tie between both of them because those islands do feel like again so much open desert place. So I love the desert level for that, which makes sense. And of course, with um, Kronos, it's just a basic island. And I think like Uranus more. I think it's like again, like I said, it's so much stuff all the place. So, but yeah, the new improvements in sweet, like you know, because we see fans do like craziness and stuff like that, though, of course, which makes sense. Yeah, like the um. It did say, like I said, the lack of, like, you know, not this, but the, um, 
Like the because we've seen like little spin dash improvement animations, like little anim new animations, which fans like they can do good. Like if you're on the good side of the Sonic fan base, they do some really good stuff. Like I said, um, it's good to see like them taking ideas because like um they, again, like I said, it's always good to see them taking ideas and doing a little stuff, taking it from fans, you know, getting inspiration from them. As even me too, like when I see like people doing art and stuff like that, I get inspiration like in YouTube videos. I get inspiration from that all the time, and I love it though. It's really cool and awesome. I love it. I think it's personally just awesome and everything in my opinion though. But yeah, seeing stuff like this, I love seeing stuff like this because they're not afraid they're not gonna be afraid to step out too much like i said they're not gonna put everything in there but i mean he's talking about the fans you know seeing them do all this stuff because again like new animations new models like the sonic x model for frontiers the classic sonic ova model um such mania model um the unleash model just so much new stuff like new animations yeah like the spin dash um like the stomp like um the slide, like, you know, this whirlwind kick, everything, like, we've seen that, though. I think, have I seen Sonic? Oh, yeah, I've seen, oh, even though it was Sonic, I guess, too, so. I mean, hey, I mean, yeah, I mean, seeing this, honestly, makes me, like, it's, like, it goes when I put everything in, but new animations, homing attack, like, new stuff, delay between homing attacks, honestly, make it more, a little bit more smoother, though, like, you know, um, make the, you know, the auto combo is a thing that helps out a lot, though, but also, like, you know, make that a little bit more smoother, though, you know, um, like all the movements, like you don't gotta keep pressing like the boost button to hit like X and Y. Yeah, I don't know. Just I don't know. Like when you're in the air, maybe like I can do like the homing shot, you know, if I'm already in the air or whatever though. But it's pretty much yeah. I think I'm just I don't want to ramble on too too long and make the video too too long. But I don't know. Like I said, we just got so much like new stuff in here. I, I can talk about this video forever. I love this type of stuff. It's insane. It's awesome. I love it though. Seeing this though, I want to see some more animation. I want to see what they can do though. I want to see what they can do. I want to see what they can do. Like this is gonna be awesome. I'm gonna love this. Like this is gonna be. Insane, like new animations, homing attack, like delay between homing attacks. That's gonna be mainly probably fixed. Maybe again, it could be a theory, like, but <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited though. I might have to make a video, another separate video, just talking about all of this because again, because I'm excited. I want to see what they can do though. I'm really excited because I want the video going too too long for you guys, but you guys don't care anyway. But yeah, I'm, I want to see more. I want to see this. I want to really want to see this though. Future updates, new animations, new homing attack stuff, new anything. I'm excited though. Maybe like onto some new three new islands. Maybe for the story update. I heard we are getting like I think three new islands, new stuff um coming up for like the DLC um, three. It was already pretty much getting leaked though and stuff like that. But I can I want to see this. I want to see this more. I'm excited. I really am excited. Though. I want to see this more. I want to just go all out see like new animations like kind of kicking like the coke like kicking up playing up with the coco um like stretching um. Like, you know, his environment, which he does that already in the game. Like, talking about it, like, the Babylon Garden and, like, Tingle Whisper. But, yeah, I'm excited. I want to see more of this stuff. I want to just, just dissect and talk about that stuff. But, yeah, enough talking, though. I feel like the video's going on too long. But, honestly, though, i love to see that, though. I would love to see that. Honestly, I would just love, love, love to see more. That's like, I, as soon as I saw this, I was like, yes, please, please, I want to explore this. Just please, I want to see more of this. That's gonna be awesome. Though. I'm gonna love that though. I'm excited. I'm really excited when they say new anime, maybe some new animations, new jumping stuff. I'm excited though. See you guys. Okay, enough talking though. I really am done. See you guys later though. No. Peace out. Oh.